everyone learners, I welcome you back. I'm Miss Hanin and I'll be giving you visual art. Let me introduce you to theme three, which is the central idea is living organisms go through different changes, phases, and can be exposed to different factors during their life cycle. In art, we will be talking about pattern, as we will use the ATI skills, thinking and creative thinking. We apply during our unit existing knowledge to design a new product. During this unit, we will be inquirers and thinkers. As I told you, in art, we will be talking about pattern. I want you to look at your right. What kind of things do you see? Do you see two colors? Or more than one color? Yes, if you look at your right, we will find two different colors. One is red and one is blue. But how can we create pattern? If you focus, we will use two colors or more than two colors to come up with our pattern. Can we create pattern in different things? If you look at your left, you can recognize that there are different patterns in front of you. But what are they made of? Yes, it's true. They are made of shapes and lines. During this week, we will discover animals using pattern. If you will look closely on the right, you will discover that there are pictures with animals. If you look at the left, there are patterns. But what are the patterns for? Yes. They are for different animals. Let's guess the first one is for who? The first one is for a zebra. Yes. How did you know it's for a zebra? Because there was lines. Let's have a guess on another one. What do you think the second one is? Yes, it's for the giraffe. This pattern is for a giraffe. During this week, we'll discover animals using a pattern, as we will create different animals using our hands to come up with our animal. We'll use colors to come up with our pattern, and we'll use our hands to create patterns on their body. So do you think a bee has a pattern? Yes, it does. If you look at the picture, you will discover that the bee has yellow, black, yellow, black pattern. Things you will see during art. This week we will use paint and colors. And during the class, we will come up with our pattern using colors. I can't wait to see you, KJ1 learners.